I, I, add, I created this page. I added everyone. You guys got a, probably a weird email at about 3 o'clock this morning or some, sometime around then. Um, and I said, don't worry about it. Just, just hold on to it for right now. Um, but I want to explain to you what this, what this is and make sure everybody has at least a little bit of experience with manipulating this so it makes sense when, it's, when it comes time to start to do stuff. <clears throat> this is a WordPress page. Now, some of you guys that are in Capstone or have been in Capstone have a WordPress page. Um, this is, uh, and so, so has, anybody, has, has anybody used WordPress before? One, two, okay, so most people haven't. Okay, that's, that's fine. So I'll, I'll, I'm gonna orient you guys to this as if you haven't manipulated WordPress before, okay? All this is, is a web page. It's a fancy name for a web page. Um, now, if you guys are doing our capstone projects where I require you guys to have your own blog, this is a little bit different in the sense that when you guys have your own page, you guys log in through CI keys. In this case, in this case, you're, you can't get to this that way because you don't own this web page. I own this web page. Okay? So just, just for those of you that have been using it in that context, note that you're going to have to get to it from a different path. You're going to, that link that I emailed you guys, which says, so if you look at this, our web page is called coastalwiki.piratelab.org. The link would have said coastalwiki.piratelab.org slash wp dash admin slash. So you don't have to click it yet. We'll, we'll do that next. But just, just so you know, you would, you would type that, type that into any browser, click on that. And then it's going to say, what's your, what's your, uh, uh, name. And so for just about everybody, I, I just use your first name. You can either use that or you can just use the email. I use the email that you got that, that you received the email uh, from WordPress earlier today. That was also the email that you guys asked to use for our scoop it stuff. So for a lot of you, it's just your regular CSUCI email. For some other folks, you guys preferred some of your alternative uh, Yahoo or whatever it was email. Just that. And then the password. The first password is ESR. So once you guys log on, no, you're going to do it now. Don't do it now. But once you do the first log on, then you can go ahead and change your password. You can make it be whatever you want. Okay? And that's how you get in. So let's have a look at what this is going to be. This is a very simple web page. So this is just going to be a place where we can uh, post our results and share our results. When you log on, or let me, let's do this. So here, for example, is, so I put up a template for each of our little areas. And each of those areas for each, so I've broken this up into themes. So we have the various overarching themes about energy or seafood or, or climate change or whatever those themes were that sort of ran through the uh, poll or are running through the poll. And so I have an introduction and I have just a filler, blah, 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 blah. And then the key questions, the ones from the survey that are relevant to this particular uh, topic. And then, you know, blah, 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 say what they were. The results, this will be... Um, you know, how many people were supportive of this position, neutral in this position, etc. And then the bulk, which is going to be you guys doing some kind of analysis. This is the same as, as other people have found elsewhere in the U.S. This seems distinct. This seems to support the position X or Y. Make sense? All the pages have this default layout here. Cool? So when we... When we get to this, you guys are just going to go and start manipulating this. Let me show you how you're going to manipulate this. When you first log on, it's going to look like this. You're going to get to the back end of our WordPress site. Those of you that have done blog stuff with us, you're used to maybe doing with posts. We're just going to do all this with pages. So if we click on pages, what you're going to see is all of the stuff that we have here is the page on fragmentation and management and fisheries, blah, 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 blah. I, I, need, I need to clean this up, make this look a little prettier for you guys, but, but that's the basic idea. 
So if, if, I, if I was going to do something about fisheries, I would go to the pages tab and I'd come up here and I would, uh, you know, say hit edit for my fisheries. And then I'm going to get to this dialog box. This is a what you see is what you get type of interface. You don't need to do any coding, don't need to do any programming, nothing super crazy fancy like that. All I need to do is come in right here in this dialog box and type, uh, this is what I am typing, right? And I, I, can, I can do whatever that is. And then after I've done it, I'm gonna hit update and then that's gonna be saved and that's gonna be now become live. Cool. Very simple. If I want to, um, so let's say I'm, I'm so as something, uh, Bubba, uh, our results were generally consistent with national polls such as uh, the Pew survey for, um, for a survey of public of U.S. public opinion. Maybe I said that. So hey, just like you guys are referencing, it's like we're, 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 learnt, we're making sure we reference all the sources. Here we go. Here's the Pew survey. And if I had the Pew survey open and I said something like Pew climate change survey, maybe this is the politics of climate change. All I would need to do is come up here, copy that source, that reference. And I come over to here and let's say if this is where I wanted it to go, I would just highlight the text, click this funky button right here that says insert or edit link. Boom, and I'm gonna paste that link in. Just cause I wanna, I don't, I, I wanna keep another tab open so I can have my page open, I'll hit that. Now, there's a hyperlink in there. Super simple, and just hit update and it's gonna update it. If, uh, and eventually you guys are gonna insert some, some you know, additional stuff, let's say graphics, let's say an image of the theme or a graph of the of the data or something like that all i would do is let's say if it's in the results here i would just come up put the cursor wherever i wanted it to be and i would say add my media and if this was the the picture let's say let me let's say i wanted to upload i would say ah oh, i'd have it on my desktop and i would scroll around to uh i don't know what this is this is something whatever okay i said insert into page boom there it is so it's so it's very easy to insert stuff it's very easy to insert hyperlinks it's very easy to insert multimedia whatever the case is one last thing i'll just have a note right here um have a look this says introduction and then here's some text where blah 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 writing notice right here when i'm on the text if i look up here i see this says paragraph and if I'm up here on this introduction part, it says heading one. So just note that I've made some headings. That just makes it a little more organized when you guys are typing in your stuff. So uh, let's not change the headings. Let's keep the headings consistent from page to page to page. You guys can obviously add in and grow and, and, and change your, uh, the text, but let's keep the headings consistent. Cool. Does that make sense? Any questions about that? Generally speaking, what we're doing? Okay, so what I'd like you guys to do now, just to make sure we're all good. So to start with, I want everybody to see if they can just log on and get onto this site. So again, you guys can go to your email and uh, check it out. I don't know why my exercise isn't up here. Let me look. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so this is what, I, okay, so after you guys get it up and running, and this, <coughs> just to know, so I know that it's working for everybody, what I want you guys to do, let me just, is just everybody have a look up here, have a quick glance up here. So here's, I made a, another page called test page that I'll delete after I know everybody can do this. So this is one of the pages. So if you click pages, you can go to the pages tab. It'll be probably at the bottom. And then, so don't do this yet. And it'll probably, it's probably gonna cause chaos if everybody tried to do this at once, but, but um, have a look up here. So what I want you guys to do is I want you to come down here and and um, manipulate this, manipulate this page, add to this page. So uh, if the next person was, or that would make sense. Uh, 
I want you guys to do it in alphabetical order. I just want you guys to type in your name and some text and insert a hyperlink into somewhere in there and then insert a picture. And then lastly, just yes, and then, just, and then lastly, make sure that your name is heading one and it makes sense. I just want to make sure you guys are all able to make this work.